Today's like our travel day. We are making some dinner. We got a nice view. It's an um, ocean view. Yeah, you want to see our view? Beautiful. Look at that. Mm. We're Kelsey and Jay, and we converted a school bus into our very own tiny home on wheels. We are taking it all around America with our baby Pippa, of course. Come along for the ride as we try to adventure in all 50 states. Let's get out, can leave this city. So we're in a um, rest area, and then tomorrow morning, we're gonna go pick up a generator. Thanks to everyone who recommended it and told us which one to get. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna make sure Chef Lachis I need your assistance, Jamie. Doesn't burn herself. Let's make some dinner. In a little bit of a mess, but today we have a surprise. What is it? I got one for us. No way. <laughs> Did you know that was a No. God, I've uh, wanted chocolate all day. <laughs> Get it? No. no. God, I've wanted chocolate all day. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, we have to put that just so you know. Jamie. Morning world, this was our spot last night, right next to the highway, gorgeous. Let's go get the generator. So my French press is broken. This coffee is like so bad. But at least we're in a beautiful location, right Jack? If you look over this way, you wouldn't even know that this is what we have. 7.30, we are on our way out of here. In the comments of our last YouTube video and on our Instagram, a lot of people have been saying to get a generator and we 100% agree. So that's where we're heading now. We're gonna go to good old Harbour Freight. Hopefully that's gonna solve all of our problems. Life is a winding road. Right, everyone say a prayer that they have it. Time for the big reveal. Let's go have a closer look. So after we finally caved and spent $700 on a generator, we were on our way to Gardener Brewing Company. So we just pulled up to this harvest host and the host was so generous. He said there's a spigot over there. Help yourself, fill up your tanks with water. They got their signs for where the harvest host member should go. He thought that Bessie was pretty cool so far like this harvest post. Let's see if we can't get some full cool drone shots of where we park. Even if I'm falling down, I will keep on searching for my highs. You can say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding if my you know, high. You know, you know. All this land for Bessie to roam. We got the generator. And we didn't get gasoline. <gasps> So we've been sweating our tits off, literally. That was my fault. But we're staying at another Harvest Host and they have a brewery. So don't mind if we do. We have to go down and get a fresh pint. We have to go pint. do our Harvest Host duty. Yeah. <laughs> Let go. I want to be there and baby dance the night away. I let my head down if I want. Do you see it? And guys, looks like once again we made it all the way to England. All the way to Stonehenge, right through there. Got a nice one. Checking her out. What a beauty. All aboard. Nice. Remember when our bus looked like this, Kels? Reminiscing when we bought Bessie. She looked a little bit better than this. But. Don't insult her, Jen. Bye. Gardner Brewing Company is a 100 year old dairy farm that makes beer and serves local wine, hard cider, and many other local items. We bought some fresh jam, sausage, and of course, some sandwiches. I don't cat. think Kelsey can wait any longer. <laughs> is it good? You need to help me get up this hill. Yeah, it's actually really good. Do you want some? Yeah, it's just sure. juice. 
It literally tastes like juice. Oh. Nice and refreshing. That's the good stuff. Every day's a vacation. <laughs> but now for the treacherous hill that we've walked up six times already today. Here she is. See you guys at the top. We did it. I think that deserves Time to a celebrate. drink. <laughs> we really can't say enough about this amazing place. Because we had so much land to ourselves, we thought it would be a great opportunity for Pippa to do a little exploring off her leash. To say we were proud parents is kind of an understatement. Pippa in the wild. I'm so proud of you. You're such a good daughter. I love you. Can I get some kisses? Can I get kisses? Where are you going? More and more. Good girl, bro. You want a treat? Does Ronnie want a treat? Oh, you're the bravest. The next morning, we had some trouble with our solar system. We're beginning to realize that sometimes with bus life, you fix one problem, like the generator, only to have another problem to fix. It's just all part of the experience of living in a bus. It's just so nice. Peaceful it is here. There's Jamie packing up the bus. Ready to go. Bye. All right, we're about 15 minutes away from the campground. I think this is like our first like drive in seeing the sights kind of moment. Jay, I love those hand motions. I'm really excited. <laughs> Look at this! This is insane! I'm so proud of Bessie for being able to get up this. All the way up this mountain. Oh my Atlanta! That is pretty spectacular. So after a quick and necessary stop, we made our way to Roundout Valley RV Campground. How much weight can that hold? We're gonna find out. Just start freaking. <laughs> giving you the thumbs up, Jen. <laughs> After being greeted with a thumbs up, we had a really good feeling about this place. I saw your video on Facebook of making this bus. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I thought it was awesome how you guys did it. Thank, oh, thank you. you. Appreciate Thanks it. Thanks so much. No problem. Yeah. I wanted to say awesome job on it. Thank, thank you, sir. <laughs> We were parked right in front of a creek, so of course we thought it was a great opportunity to put our crabbing skills to the test. Or, I did at least. Chelsea's crabbing. It's like deadliest catch. You have to move very slowly. There's one, Where? under this rock right here. I've got a big one! Do you think he'll pinch me though? I hope so. Okay. Ah. Too scared. He's huge! He's a crab. Oh, I touched him, he didn't bite me. He just moved really fast. Whoa, did you see the speed on him? Thanks. <laughs> Look at Bessie. She's supervising. Getting that crowd. Later it's gonna go home to his friend and be like, I have the craziest day. So we're fishing for dinner. We don't catch, we don't eat. Oh, that one. Wait. Oh, we scare each other. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, you're probably just scared the Jesus out of it. Hey guys, I went flying today. I thought it was a crab, but today I flew. Oh my god, that one's huge. Oh that wow. That is the mom. That's the backup. He's coming over, no, that's the mom coming over to see if his kid's okay. Oh my god, he's coming towards me. Just on my way to work. I've got to provide for the family, you know. Another day in the river, we didn't catch anything, so. Just gonna starve, it's fine. We're going hungry tonight. Bessie, we're home. So although, although we may have not found any dinner at the pond. Jamie's about to get his booty beat in a game of cards. Aren't you, Jay? Yeah. <laughs> Chelsea. What? 
I feel something coming on. What? Some B-roll! Okay, rain stopped play, so I guess we'll never know who the real winner was. He's a sore loser. No. I guess we'll never know. Um, but we have something fun to tell you guys. We're gonna do two videos a week! You get to see more of us! I don't know you if that's a good thing. You lucky people! I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but... Here's what's <laughs> coming on Wednesday. Oh, I don't know why I'm tearing up a little bit, but I didn't have to do that. I don't know if I'm just being emotional or not. We're running low on water, low on snacks. This is, oh my god. Oh. I don't know if this can bring me back to life, Jeff. So, if you've been following along, so if you've been following along, my hair is getting out of control, but I'm just letting, I'm just letting it go. I'm letting it do it on, I'm letting it do it, I'm letting it do it on. Oh my god. I don't even know, it's like this, right? <laughs> I'm like dyslexic right now, dancing. <laughs> Just with dancing. What are you doing? It's like a, like a... 